Go to minus. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure you'd like to show your appreciations uh, to a very courageous opponent indeed, Rod Lloyd. His opponent into the blue corner, please welcome uh, the Welsh warrior, Gordon Miners. Ladies and gentlemen, the officials appointed for this contest, the judges at ringside, Mr. Tony Myers, uh, Mr. Les Weaver, and Mr. John Backledge. The referee in charge of the action, Mr. Steve Hart. Ladies and gentlemen, sponsored by Fighter Magazine, uh, BritishMultai.com, uh, GWS, and Asian Express on Channel 5 and uh, Fuji TV in Japan, Show Sport International present here at Aston Villa Leisure Centre, Big fight time, and the final of the K1 Battle of Britain 2003. Between and introducing in the red corner, coming from the farm row, weighing in at 96 kilograms, uh, with a record of 33 contests, 22 wins, 10 losses, and one draw. Please welcome Farmer's Gary Turner. And across the ring in the blue corner from Wrexham win, 99 kilograms, a combined record from uh, pro Thai kickboxing and professional boxing of 44 contests, 37 wins, uh, five losses and two draws. Presenting from Wrexham, the Welsh warrior, Gordon Miner. Three, three minute rounds. Right, here we go, the K1 heavyweight final, the Battle of Britain, Gordon Minor versus Gary Turner. I have with me Howard Hughes. Howard, both men come through tough... Round players. one! They know each other, they fought a 10-rounder before, great deal of mutual respect, but that'll mean nothing now they've started, won't it? That's right, this is the K1 final, all to win, nothing to lose. As the poster says, last man standing, so let's see who the last man will be standing tonight. Up to two, possibly. Gordon had the harder... Oh, what's oh, happened here? It's his foot, it's his shin. It's his foot, Gary Turner's going, his foot's gone. Gary Turner looked over to his corner and said his foot's gone. It was the kick that Gordon Miner threw, possibly straight onto an elbow. What a disappointment for the, for the final of the K-1 for Gordon Miner's. He's Just saying it's the foot, Howard, but it, as you're right, what an anti-climax, what a disappointment. We were saying earlier, these both, both these men know each other, they like each other. We had a good 10-round fight. We were both saying how much the other one would bring to the table, and immediately you can see it. You can Gordon Miner's put his arms up to say there's something wrong. Doctor's taking a close look now at his ankle and foot. The foot swelling. Uh, the, you can see here it's ballooning. Look. It's ballooning immediately. Not sure how the judges see this one now, but it looks like it could be even a win for, for Mr. Gary Turner. He's shaking his head, Gordon Mine. It would be an awful way to have to end this. I don't think Gary Turner would want it this way either, Howard. That's right, he's a warrior. He'd like to fight to the end. 
but Gordon is having real trouble getting to his feet. The doctor's having a very close look at it. Gordon Miners certainly won't be continuing the fight tonight. Gary's going, is he OK? You know, I think you're right, it's over. Gary said to him, are you OK? Gordon shook his head. It's such a shame that with such mutual respect and such a hard passage for both men that it ends like this. That's right, and that's the nature of the game. So, Howard, let's see if we can see that where the damage is done here. A nice opening start. Ah, there maybe just even in that exchange there where Gordon Mine is blocked. Yes, it's see, a delayed reaction. Up, it's it's that right. block, Howard, you're dead right. A delayed reaction there. But it's all over. Very unfortunate for Gordon Miner because he came right through two hard battles. To go so quickly in this, Gary, obviously, he said he was hoping to get Gordon because he'd been through those battles. That's right. Can I please have into the ring our uh, promoter this evening, Mr. Paul Hennessy, to present the trophies. So, Paul Hennessy from Showsport International, the man behind the K1 heavyweight explosions here, the Battle of Britain, the last man standing, he's going to present the trophies. And an unfortunate end, but that is fighting, that's the way it goes. That is fighting, and the decision is going to go. Ladies the and new gentlemen, K1 champion 2003 indeed, Battle indeed, of Britain, uh, Mr. Gary Turner. The winner of the Battle of Britain 2003, the K1 champion, Gary Turner! Yes, Gordon Miner sportingly applauding that. It's not the way he'll have wanted to go out. But Gary Turner, a worthy winner, and he's always and Ladies and gentlemen, now, please give your sin little ethic appreciation. That's right, Gary Turner came to fight and would have fought to the end. So he deserves the victory. Even though, you know, it was, a, it was a, an injury fault. Still a good victory for Mr. Gary Turner. Yes, the K1 heavyweight champion. I have with me Gary Turner, the K1 heavyweight champion from the Battle of Britain. Gary, wouldn't have ended the way you expected there. Definitely not. You know I've got to go back and fight Gordon again properly now. We fought before over 10 rounds and it was scored a draw. And that was about five, six years ago. So this time, we, we were looking, we actually said before I came out, Gordon, we're finally going to get a decision. This is not how I want to win this, although I'm sure it would be the end result. <laughs> <laughs> but I would say that, wouldn't I? Um, but it's not the way I'd wanted, wanted it to end. What, what I think happens from talking to Gordon is that when I threw the leg kick, um, as he blocked it, it caught right on a previous injury. And I don't know whether the cameras will pick it up from, the, from their angles, but when the, when the doctor touched it, he, for a big guy, he really yelped in pain. Um, he wasn't able to carry on. And knowing Gordon as well as I do, and how many shots he's taken tonight, if he can carry on, he will. So, yeah, I'm K1 champion, although it's a little bit of a hollow victory because I do it for the personal challenge. And Gordon's one hell of a personal challenge. <laughs> so we'll probably fight again and, you know, we'll finally actually get a proper decision between us. But it's a nice feeling. Well, Gary, I was just about to say that from everyone here, congratulations, you are the K1 heavyweight champion. Thank you very much. Cheers. Well done, Gary. Ladies and gentlemen, we now go into our second uh, special contest of the evening and welcome, uh, firstly, into the red corner.